Hi everyone, it's Giselle with a dream interpretation message for today. I haven't had dreams that were majorly significant for quite a little while, but last night something very memorable um, happened in my dream and I dreamt that I was in a car, I wasn't driving, I was in the back seat with my family, and there were ladybirds just appearing out of nowhere because the windows in the car were closed and the ladybirds appeared in groups of three which is quite significant of course of the trinity and all that um but it it was just interesting how when i woke up i i knew ladybirds represented good luck i know some countries call them ladybugs do they yeah but we call them ladybirds over here <laughs> um they represent good luck. And then I looked into it a bit more. It's it's sort of tying in with the fortune, abundance, love, overflowing um, abundance of all those things, basically, of your heart's desires. The fact that they came into threes signifies as well the support of the spirits um, plane helping us to achieve our dreams, basically. And then the fact that they just popped in to the car when the car was closed was quite interesting and what we had to do is because they were flying up towards the window is to let them free but they were huge they were huge ladybirds they weren't like normal size they were massive um also actually thinking about it and analyzing it more now one ladybird popped up first on its own but that was a quite small ladybird and that one was accidentally flicked I think my mum didn't know what it was and she just flicked it off my clothes and I was like oh my god you just squashed a ladybird and um after that the th groups of three appeared and they were huge so what I feel that represents in my own life is the limiting beliefs of not just parents but society squashing your dreams basically i know it sounds awfully dramatic but that's how i feel that that was represented but now that my brother's awakening has also um helped to shake up my mother's awakening and her realization of powers and able to manifest your dreams and being more into that and actually grasping and and hanging on to that a lot more than she used to awakening a bit slower but awakening nonetheless and then, you know, the groups of three ladybirds came up. They were huge, humongous ladybirds. They were massive, you know. And so we had to let them free. And the freedom is to say, you are getting this abundance, but you're letting it free for the world to accept these ladybirds and for the world to then have the freedom of abundance that you're experiencing. And that's why I feel that represented. Um, it was a beautiful dream really. Um, I had a reading with a client last night and I, I did mention to him, I was like, I haven't really dreamt anything significant in a while, actually. And I usually don't dream anything significant when I have the chance to have a little bit of a lie-in. I only dream when there's limited time to sleep, <laughs> which is weird, right? Um, but yeah, I I dreamt of this and I thought I would share it because I felt it was such a significant dream that I had to share it. I couldn't just keep it to myself so um if that resonates for anyone i'd be interested to know um also i would like to say about the um end of well cyber monday until the end of november sale it's still on today today's the 28th right yeah today up until the 30th basically so you still have just two and a half-ish days, I would say. Uh, if you wanted to take advantage of that, you can get up to 33% off the readings. Those are the bundles. Uh, phone readings have up to 25% off. So uh, do pop on my website and have a little look under special offers if you're interested. I would also like to thank all the people booking with me, all the new clients, all my loyal clients. You guys are amazing. And anyone watching this video, thank you so much for your support. I hope that this message has helped you and have a beautiful day. Namaste.